indicator circuit so we know that for the vehicle we are having an indicator left side indicator and right side indicator and we have to understood that how this particular indicator is working and how the uh, blinking motion of that particular light is actually you can see that this is the dashboard gauges on the dashboard we are having a button like this and from this i can make the electricity on off from this this is the button specifically provided for indicator circuit in this case let's understand a construction of this you can see that this is a front left light this is front right light this is rear left light this is rear right light so these are four lights when i am going for a left side when i am going for left side i want to make these two lights to be blinking when i am going for right side i want these two light to be a blinking now when i am going on left side this two light has to be on for making on off what we have used we have used this particular system this particular is called as a flashing indicator switch this one flashing indicator switch from the indicator switch there is a small lamp left pilot lamp and left right pilot lamp these two lamp will be also available on the dashboard gauges so when we make left side light on this pilot lamp will also blink at the same time when i go for right side movement this right side lamp also will be a blinking then the connection from the battery will be coming like this this is a fuse for the safety purpose we are using a fuse when the more electricity is flowing through the circuit the fuse will get burned and it can save the total circuit this is a flasher unit in the flasher unit generally we are using a thermostatic blade and that thermostatic blade make the circuit on off and that electricity goes to here here in the flashing indicator switch we can observe that there is one central rod and that rod can move left and right by pressing the button so when we press the button this particular button on the left side when it we move this on left side this small arrow moves toward left side and the electricity will go to the left side when i move this particular on the right side this particular rod will move towards right side and electricity will go to the right side system this is what the system when we make indicator switch on let's say i want to go for a left side i will move towards left side and this will move towards left side the electricity which is coming from a battery it will go through the fuse from fuse it will go to the flasher flash from flasher it goes to the left side when it goes to the left side now three light will get burned so this is the first light will get glow this one second and this one third this third three bulb will get glow and we can have the uh, running of the bulb but how it will it has made on off that is because of this flasher this flasher unit make the circuit on and off now how it make it let's understand for that purpose we are use thermostatic blade arrangement so this is thermostatic blade arrangement we are use it thermostatic blade as we are knowing these are made up of two different metal which are having a two different coefficient of thermal expansion as they are having a two different coefficient of thermal expansion when we heat it it will get bent and when it get bent so we can achieve this particular system when it is straight vertical the circuit will be working electricity will be flowing when we heat it when electricity will be flowing through this one these metal are having a high resistance to the electricity and as it is high resistance to the electricity it will get heated by itself and when it get by heated by itself it will get bent on this particular side if you observe this a left side blade in which is indicated which is shown by the blue color and if you see the blade on the right side which is shown by the red color in these two blades the blue color blade which is having a high thermal coefficient and as it is high thermal coefficient the length of that will go on increases and hence we can actually bend it so when electricity flows gets heated bend is achieved the system will get become off when it become off the electricity is not now flowing and as electricity is not flowing the it will get cool and after getting cool it will become again straight vertical when it become straight vertical the system will become on when it get bent it will become off so there will be continuously on off situation so when it straight the on on means what the electricity is going to the flashing indicator switch and then these two will be working when it becomes off off means what when it get bent when it become off then electricity is not going to the system and the lamp will get off so continuously on off motion of the two lamp can be achieved by using the flasher in a similar case for the right side when this small rod moves to our right side 
the right side bulb will be get glowed will be get will become on and what happen because of flash error in it it may become on and off continuously so like this the indicator circuit can be work thank you very much for listening